Hi, good evening. Hope you're all doing well. In today's video, I want to discuss how to change our life, to, cha to change our situation. It first starts with a thought. Now, if I think back to when I was like 18, 19 years old, and I compare where I am now, obviously physically I'm different, you know, we all kind of um, mature and our body changes, etc. But really, what I think it comes down to is thinking what I, the person I was 20 years ago compared to what the person that I am today I think basically comes down to how I think and I think very differently so you may have come across this something similar before the thought that we have then drives our feelings and then our feelings then reinforce our behavior and we will act basically based on our feelings so for example let's give a really uh, simple straightforward example let's say for example you have the idea oh i, I want to kind of get into good shape i want to get health healthy fit and healthy so that initially then may start with the thought and then as you then have a positive feeling about that so you think okay how will i how will i feel uh, being fitter and healthy obviously I, I i might feel better about it so then you think okay let's act upon these feelings and maybe do something about it let's join a gym membership let's start doing some exercise um, undertake a program and then so then you you act your behavior then changes and then it goes in like a circle, in like a loop. So that then reinforces the thought. So for example, let's say you do go to the gym and you do start to feel uh, better, more healthier from as a result of training. It then reinforces the thought that, yeah, um, doing exercise and looking, taking care of your health is a really good thing to do. So I think this is a feedback loop, uh, which I've noticed. Uh, and it is quite, it's quite, it's useful to be, I'm aware of this so really I was I was thinking you know that is that pattern is really useful in kind of initiating a positive change in your life and essentially what it comes down to is actually thinking the way you think can have a big impact uh, on your life because thinking that if you if you're mindful of how you think you you will then uh, realize that you can um, manage your feelings better and you will act uh, in a way which I think is more balanced. I, so I watched a really interesting video by Russell Brand actually this evening and he was talking about how to develop self-confidence and what did he say? Let me have a look. He said yes, I think this is really good. He said um, to develop self-confidence it's you have to work on yourself and not judge yourself and what I think he means by that is, by not uh, judging yourself, I think he means don't be too harsh, don't be too kind of self-critical and just keep on working on yourself. And I think to work on yourself, you could maybe implement something like this, where you, you know, you, you control what you think. You, uh, this will then have a, a positive impact on how you feel and then because of that it will maybe catalyze how you behave so then it becomes like a mechanism to um, improve uh, the action okay so just a little video there I, I hope you found it useful if you've got any questions or any comments you know um, please, please feel free to comment down below take care and we'll speak soon bye bye